graduation day? Uh, it was it was fun and exciting. Something I've been looking forward to for a few years now. How did you um, did you go back and finish? Did you do um, online? Did you actually go to class at some points? No, it, it was a, a deal over the line, over online. I didn't, I couldn't go back to the actual classroom. And yeah. Do it. yeah. What, why was it a lot important of, to you to get that finished? Uh, I mean, for one, that's what you go to school for a period to get your degree and um, to get your education and get a reward for it and then that's getting your diploma and my mom and my dad well everybody in my family you know it's, it's been a big deal to them to to have that so i want to get that also did they prod you to do it a lot or was that did a lot of it come from within uh initially like when i first left school i i went on and started training for the combine my mom she was like and we gonna go back and finish we gonna go back and finish and she kind of was after me for the first year about about that she left it alone and but it was more of me really wanting to get back and get it. Once you got back into it and into the world was it was it hard to get back into it? Uh no it wasn't. Mm -hmm. uh, if much, you really want to do it just go do it. How much last for how many credits did you still have to get when you when you left? I was just one class short. <laughs> so, <laughs> so yeah. So, so what was that last class? You said what? what was the last class you had to take? Uh, it was a stats class. Okay. Yeah. You're saving the best for last. Man. Yeah, if you want to say that. <laughs> <laughs> so your degree wound up in. You said what now? What was your degree in? Uh, general studies. Okay. What, what do you think um, with your degree now in hand, post playing career? Maybe it's too far to think about it, but do you have any sense of what, how, what you might want to do with your degree? Um, yeah, I mean, I want to go back and get some more things, and there's some other things I want to do um, later on. I really don't want to talk about it right now, but I got I got a, a, a few plans I want to do, and yeah, it'll be it'll be nice. What's been your observation so far about Coach Cable, the new system? What do you, what are you seeing out there? Oh, uh, I mean, to me they have an answer for everything, you know. Um, it's a good system. I you know I can't go into details about it, but um, it takes some studying to do to get into it and uh, to learn everything. And I want to say it's the easy, I want to say it's the hardest, but you have to really pay attention to the details. Coach Gruden told us a minute ago that they they threw a lot of different stuff at, at you guys and a lot of different kind of blocking schemes and some gap and some zone and you find that you guys are challenged mentally. Oh yeah, they they want to you know test us mentally and see what what can we handle, what we can't handle, and um, just to see where we at as a, as a group. And um, I mean we've been doing a good job at it. I mean they're doing a good job in, in coaching us to get us to that point to understand it. What are your first impressions been of? Uh, good. I mean, they 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 don't talk much. Uh, I've said a few things to them. They real like quiet guys as of now. They probably maybe good talkers, but they've been quiet. But they they've been working and, and you know working hard. What about uh, Reno over right next to you at the right tackle? What are you seeing from him? I mean, he's a veteran. He's been around. Uh, I mean, he's he's real smart. He he know the game and um, he, he's a character. He's funny, but uh, he he know the game. He know what's going on and and and, and, is, and a good person to be beside. What's this off, what was this offseason like for you just to kind of physically get back to where you needed to be? Yeah, just getting my body back, feeling halfway right. It ain't going to be, you know, always feeling great, but just feeling good and uh, getting things that was bothering me during the, during the season worked out so I can be able to uh, be at my best. How much were you battling through last year? It seemed like there was definitely parts of it where it's pretty clear that you were just giving what you had. Well, the, the main thing, well, foot, one of those, my foot one time, one foot, and then the, a few weeks after that was the other foot, and it was like a continual thing throughout the, the whole year. But I mean, I, I got it I got it done. So did you have to do anything off season other than stay off the feet? Did you have to take care of it all or no? Uh, most of just let it rest. I mean, you can try to do like stuff to strengthen, you know, things, but most of just let it rest and before you get back in the swing of things. Good enough to walk. Yeah. <laughs>